Once you get signed into the blog, the way you get started is pretty easy. You're going to go over here to the top right hand corner and you're going to click on new post. And that will bring you to the post screen. And give your post a title, um, something that makes sense to you and is relevant to your content. And then come to this screen, and this is just a word processor screen, so just like Microsoft Word or any other word processor, and you can control the font type, the text, um, bold and italics, all that good stuff. Um, usually it's best just to leave all those to the default so that the block looks the same. And so you can begin typing, and uh, it can be really just about anything. It's not not important what you type so much as how you type it. Um, you know, obviously you're going to have in mind what you want to type, so that doesn't really mean anything. So once you get something typed, if you want to include a link, like a lot of times you just say, I really like this, or if you want to say, this is a good video, highlight the word this and click link and then you would put the URL um, for the video that you need and you can even test the link to make sure that it works and then that will provide a link to something that you find relevant so now you have a link if you want to in a picture you can insert an image here and you can upload it directly from your computer or you can upload a picture from another URL um, it's good to make sure that you have the rights to use it make sure it's not a copyrighted image um, or that the image is licensed in such a way that you can reuse it and in addition to that, you can also add in videos. And videos can be from YouTube or your uh, computer, or if you have a YouTube channel, you can go directly to the URL for your YouTube channel and embed that as well. You can also use the embed codes from video. Um, anytime you go to YouTube, there'll be an embed code, and you can insert that as well. Um, if you feel comfortable editing in the HTML, you can click on Edit HTML and add things in HTML. But usually the best way is just to stick with this, um, what's called a WYSIWYG. Uh, what you see is what you get. If you want to check out your post before it gets published, you can hit Preview. And you can see exactly what it will look like before you post it. And whenever you're ready, just hit Publish Post. And so the finished post looks like this. Now, if you read someone else's post and you want to comment on it, it that's even simpler. Once you're signed in, you'll be able to type right here in this box and post a comment. And then that'll show up on that main screen right underneath the post. That's really all there is to it. After this, we will be starting our conversation. So if there's something that you feel strongly about or passionate about or something that you think would be a good idea, by all means, that's what you need to be posting about, starting that conversation. And then try to respond to the comments so that you can keep the conversation going. Um, that would be the best way to, to get everyone involved and, and get people started.